Yeah. So many people. There, there appears to be a major operation now underway to move people out of this area near the, uh, the theatre. Um, so it may be that uh, there are thankfully a, a lot of people who have survived and are now being moved uh, to safer uh, surroundings. Well, we've been told that hospitals are moved to worldwide emergency plans, so you'd imagine a lot of the right. people are uh, being taken the there. The officials now from uh, the Paris city government are saying five attackers, and they uh, are believed to be dead in the various attacks across the city. So that's the picture that they're building up. Um, just to show you here, Stade de France in the north of the city where there was an explosion, three dead. The restaurant there near Goncourt uh, metro station, the Bataclan concert hall, the greatest number of deaths. Some reports too of, of shootings at Leal, the shopping mall, no further details on that. But now it indicated that there were five attackers uh, at these various sites having launched these uh, deadly attacks by gun and uh, explosions. Uh, none of them have survived. Just to reiterate, uh, these live pictures we believe are buses being brought to take away survivors from the scene at the theatre, despite, well, maybe 120 we are getting as the latest suggestions having been killed in, in this uh, series of, of explosions and, and shootings before the police moved in and killed the two attackers there. Yes, and of course the highest death toll.